Good evening. Residents in Allenby Gardens have been devastated by the loss of a well-known local man who died after a car struck his wheelchair this morning. Police are now investigating what caused the crash on such a quiet suburban street. 75-year-old Raymond Ball was well known for driving his motorised wheelchair around the streets of Allenby Gardens. Sadly, this morning's journey to a local cafe would be his last. He normally goes every morning, he goes to a cafe on down the road mm. to have a coffee. And I did not expect it. I, yeah, I know it was certain, but it doesn't expect it this way. The disabled pensioner was struck on Brand Avenue at quarter past nine, allegedly by this Ford sedan which was towed from a nearby home under police guard this afternoon. Initially, the victim complained of having only a sore back and was taken home. But five minutes later, on the insistence of paramedics, he was taken to the Queen Elizabeth Hospital. He passed away a short time later. Locals knew Raymond well and have been left devastated. Oh, he's a lovely man. He comes to my work. Um, I work in an optical store down the road and he comes to clean his glasses. She used to say hello to him a couple of times and he used to stop and say hello, have a bit of a yarn. Nirmal Singh and his family shared a home with the victim and say they're deeply saddened. Just like a family, you know, it's been around. We have known him from about seven, eight years now. Mm -hmm. So it's just like a family. It's hard news for the family, that's what, that's what it is. Ben Avery joins us from the scene and Ben, have police revealed how it happened? Well, they have revealed that both the wheelchair and the car were travelling in the same direction here on Brand Avenue this morning when they collided, but uh, the exact circumstances of the crash are now subject to a major crash investigation. So anyone who may have witnessed the collision here this morning is certainly urged to contact Crime Stoppers on 1800 333 000. Will? Thanks very much, Ben.